Hey, what's going on guys in this video i'm going to be showing you how you can uh, unlock your uh, western digital external hard drive on your which is password protected on your linux system so let me just show you if i uh, plug in my external hard drive in my uh, linux system I'll open the file and you'll get this wd drive unlock dot exe and you'll be familiar with this extension yes it is a windows operating system this file is only will run only on your windows system now how do we unlock this drive how do we browse the files that are on this hard disk uh, I was searching on the internet and I stumbled upon this uh, on this website I put the link in the description yeah, this guy has also made a YouTube video uh, while I was following this video I got stuck at some places and hopefully I'll also cover those issues in this video now, with that being said uh, let's get started and uh, this first thing you need to do is uh, download the zip file I have already downloaded it so it's in my uh, downloads folder <clears throat> And this is the zip file right here. I need to extract it. Let's just extract it right here. Extract and extraction is complete. This is the folder that you will get. Okay, now open up the terminal and uh, uh, click on this link. This is like the instruction manual. Uh, you have to just run a few commands and uh, you'll be able to unlock your you'll be able to browse the files of your hard disk on your Linux system. So this is the first command. I'll just copy it and paste it in the terminal right there. Uh, I need to, you'll see this attached SCSI disk. You need to, this is the name of your external hard disk SDB. So we need to remember this. We need to use it. We have to use this name at the end the last command when we run our last command okay we need to go to the folder where we have uh, downloaded our file so it's in uh, downloads folder so I'll type in CD space uh, download downloads and if I type in LS it will list all the files and folders in that download folder this is the folder that we need so again copy that uh, folder name cd space and paste in that folder name right there now we are in that uh, folder right now uh, now let's run the second command and uh, paste in right there now you need to replace the uh, the password uh, which is written in uppercase we need to replace it with the uh, the real password that we have set up for our external hard disk so mine is 17458 and hit enter now you'll get this permission denied now to fix that you just have to type in chmod u plus x uh, space uh, name of that uh, python script so that was cook pw dot py and now hit enter and you can now again run that command without any permission denied error now with that uh, now let's uh, look at the next step is to install the sg3 utils so again uh, open up your web browser I have this link in the description just visit this link and click on this download and build and scroll down till you see the latest version which is 1.42 uh, at the time of making this video and you'll need to install a dev file so this first one is for the 32-bit architecture i386 and this AMD64 is for 64-bit architecture so mine is 64-bit so I'm gonna I have already downloaded it again I'll go to the downloads folder it's right here double click on it and it will open the software center click on install might want to click it again 
type in the password if you have any and it's installed now uh, uh, let's copy the third command uh, which is this one right here copy it and go back to the terminal and uh, paste in that command right there now right here you just have to uh, change this letter SDD to whatever uh, it was at uh, the this right here you guys have to replace it with the letters that are right here written so in my case it's SDB it can be SDD SDB SDABC XYZ anything so you just have to type in whatever it is there and uh, hit enter on your keyboard type in the password and you'll see this SCSI status code that means you will be now be able to browse the files on your Linux system I hope this video was helpful if it was please do leave a like and also check out this guy his YouTube uh, account as well maybe subscribe him uh, like his video uh, I don't know do anything to make him happy because he has done some amazing uh, work yeah with that being said I'll, I'll see you in the next video then take care and uh, goodbye